Have you ever thought about building your own vertical garden? Imagine the lush greenery, the vibrant colors from various plants and flowers, and the satisfaction of growing them all by yourself in a space-saving, eye-catching design. Today, we're going to walk you through the process, step by step. The first thing you need to do is decide on the location for your vertical garden. It can be an outdoor wall, a balcony, even an indoor wall if you have enough light. Just make sure it's a place where your plants can thrive. Next, you need to choose the right plants for your vertical garden. Consider the amount of sunlight your chosen location gets and pick plants that will thrive in those conditions. Some plants like succulents and ferns do well in shaded areas, while others like petunias and marigolds require plenty of sunlight. Now that you have your location and plants, it's time to gather your materials. You'll need a vertical garden frame which you can purchase or build yourself using a pallet or grid. You'll also need potting soil, a staple gun, landscape fabric, and of course, your chosen plants. Ready to start building? Begin by attaching the landscape fabric to your frame using a staple gun. This fabric acts as a barrier to keep the soil in place. Once it's secure, you can start filling your frame with potting soil. With your frame filled with soil, you can now start planting. Create small holes in the landscape fabric and gently insert your plants into these openings. Make sure to pack the soil around the roots of each plant to ensure they're properly secured. After planting, give your vertical garden a good watering. This will help settle the soil and ensure your plants start their new life well hydrated. Remember to keep an eye on your vertical garden, especially in the first few weeks. Water it regularly and trim any overgrown plants to keep the garden looking its best. So to recap, building a vertical garden involves choosing the right location, selecting suitable plants, gathering your materials, attaching landscape fabric to your frame, filling it with soil, planting your chosen greens, and giving it a good watering. However, it's not just about following steps. It's also about understanding your plant's needs, being patient, and most importantly, enjoying the process. Building a vertical garden allows you to create a green oasis in a small space and brings you closer to nature. So go on, give it a try. Cultivate your green thumb, save space, and create a unique piece of living art with your very own vertical garden. Happy gardening!